Stopping by my channel, Beyond the Moon, I'm doing a peek at your person, love tarot reading. All right, so Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. If this does not resonate, please check your other placements for messages there. Feel free to cross watch, but don't force anything to fit. Okay, it is a general reading. Um, so Libra, stick with me till the end. I have a fun, exciting announcement to make, so stick around. All right, so I'm going to get into your overall energy and your person's overall energy, their current energies, blockages, how they feel about you, potential outcome, obstacles, and advice. So stay tuned. All right, so we have your overall energy, flexible and to the sea. Libra, I feel like you are being very flexible. I feel like you want a new beginning I, and you're trying to move to calmer waters. This is like the Six of Swords here. I feel like you're really trying to find like peace, tranquility, calmness, balance. Um, but I feel like you're really after some kind of a new start here. Uh, let's see, your person's overall energy, not for you. Ooh, what else? Libra's person's overall energy. Message in a bottle and treasure island, bottom of the deck. <sighs> and thinker soulmates all right well i feel like your person I'm trying to decipher i don't know if this is a new connection or if this is a, a separation all right i feel like if it's a new person uh libra i feel like you're trying to be flexible with them and like you just want things to like go to a calm place and like chill and your person might be feeling like, mm, this may not be for me. And you might receive a message about that. Or there's something in their life that's not for them. And you might receive a message about that. Because they might look at you like you're worth it. You're a good value. You're worth the squeeze here. All right, let's see. I'm going to get into their current energies and dig in and see what's going on. Confusion, confusing start already, but we'll get through it. All right, current energies for Libra's person. Current energies for Libra's person. What is going on, Libra's person? Ten of Wands. All right, they're carrying a heavy burden here. I feel like they want to put that down and end the burden. We have the Moon, Pisces, Cancerian energy. Something could have happened, like on the full moon that just passed. Or there's something hidden, unknown, unclear. Person's stressed out. They want to talk, though. Uh, they may... Oh, oh, is this like a breakup reading? They may want to talk about, like, moving on or moving forward. There's something about them being stressed out. And wanting to communicate. Oh, man. Could be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. <sighs> Libra, I feel like your person may want to call it quits here. Or may have recently called it quits. There could have been like possessiveness, jealousy, unlevel emotions, emotional outbursts. Gemini energy, Knight of Swords. Um, in and out. Energy, actions don't match their words, rushing in, love bombing, causing chaos, leaving. Making you feel like this could be something and it's not, not really communicating their needs. But I feel like communication is going to come in here. Scorpionic energy, transformation. Something could change. Hold on, what's blocking this connection? Eight of Pentacles. You could work together with this person. Or this person wasn't putting in the work and effort. Scorpionic energy, karma, judgment, reconciliation. Hmm. Libra. Libra, Libra, Libra. What is happening here? This person could have been juggling. 
Could be dealing with a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. I feel like things were just moving so painfully slow. Like this person was just moving so slow. To make a decision. To figure out what they want. Do they want a relationship? Do they want to be single? What do they want? What do they want? I feel like you were saying you were trying to be flexible with them. But it's like, what do you want? There was no truth and clarity. Victory is being blocked here. That Ace of Swords. The Lovers. Gemini energy. Secrets. Scorpio um, Pisces energy. Intuition being blocked. There could This person could have secrets. I feel like they had a choice in love to make. Oof. The Empress. Could be a Taurus that they had to choose from. Or it could be the mother or father of their kids. Or maybe they got someone pregnant. That could be a secret here. You could be receiving a message from this person that maybe they got someone pregnant or they became pregnant. But I also feel like there was no loving, caring, nurturing energy here from your person. I feel like your person was very cold or played games or something. All right, let's see. How do they truly feel about you, Libra? The Fool, Aries energy. Feel like they were acting a fool. The magician. Nine of cups. Nine of wands. Five of cups in the reverse. Man, I feel like this person was just like manipulative, trickery. fuckery going on here I feel like they were like playing you for a fool I feel like they were using every trick in the box to string you along this person could could drink a lot overindulge in alcohol or partying whatever substance sex I feel like they, they, I'm getting, they played you for a fool. They played you for a fool. And the whole time they had their walls up or you had your walls up and they were trying to break through your walls to like string you along. I don't feel like they regret any bit of it. They know, Libra, that you wanted long-term. They know that you wanted a solid relationship, and I don't feel like they did. I don't feel like they were valuing this, protecting this. They, they were just constantly, like, turning their back or indecisive. I don't know what I want. They know what you want. You made it clear. You wanted a real relationship. You wanted real. You wanted long term. You wanted something to grow and go somewhere. And I feel like this person completely ignored that value that you have. Made you like lower your guard down. This person's attractive. They're flirty. They're fun. They're adventurous. They're spontaneous. They're... Probably really good in bed. They're probably really funny. Good sense of humor. That they know. Oh, I'm feeling major, major player energy here. Just manipulative energy. I don't like it. <laughs> Libra, I don't like it. They they fool they played you for a fool. Ugh. All right, let's see. Potential outcome here. And here you are being all sweet and kind and you're like, yeah, I'm just going with the flow. This person may get a lot of attention or loves attention being in the spotlight. We have Six of Wands, the High Priestess, so Scorpio, Pisces Energy, Ten of Pentacles, Ace of Cups, Four of Pentacles, Five of Cups, Three of Wands. This person's just going to keep you waiting. It's false promises. You're going to end up regretting every little bit of energy you put into this. 
It's false. It's false starts. They may come to you and even like promise you like the Ten of Pentacles, promise you like a solid relationship, but I feel like it's going to leave you feeling sad, regretful, wishing you didn't, stuck in your head, arguing with yourself. There's that damn fool again, Aries energy. Usually the fool, I'm like... Be the fool. Go into the unknown. Take that leap of faith. The universe will catch you if you fall. That's always what I preach. And this time, uh-uh. Not preaching that. This person played you for a fool. We got the fool again. Aries energy. Eight of swords. They're keeping you stuck. They don't want to lose you, but they don't want to commit to you. So they're keeping you stuck with false lies pretending things that are, are moving forward. It's fake. Could be an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Could be another air sign. Wow. 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 King and Queen of Pentacles, King and Queen of Swords. Oh, wow. I'm getting, like, this person's like a chameleon. Like, they're very good at adapting to other people's energies to attract what they want, but it's not a permanent thing. It's like, whatever, male or female, you guys, there's no gender in tarot. It's like, like you want this long term, and they're, they're in this energy or in this energy. They're very cold and cut off, and you want the long term. But then they come back and they like try to match the energies, but they don't match like authentically. You know what I'm saying? Like they, they're good. They're good. And they also come in as this fiery, attractive, fun, passionate, sexual, attractive, gotta have you type energy. And then you end up feeling like this. And this, left out in the cold, heartbroken, mm, not good, not good energy. Ooh, use your own discernment here. I don't think they're, I don't think this person's going to leave unless you block them and, and leave them. Because they're going to keep getting what they want from you because they see you as being really flexible and... You know, they come in with romantic offers, gestures, they take you out. It's like the world stops when you guys are together, but it's set on a false pretense. It's, it's not real. You want commitment. They don't. They don't. All right, let's see. Hmm. Biggest obstacle Libra is going to have to overcome. Biggest obstacle. We will get into that right after this quick message. Thank you so much for sticking with me until this point in your reading. It is not over. I just wanted to make a real quick announcement. I am doing a 10K subscriber giveaway. A bunch of goodies are going to be given out, and I am so excited. I can't wait. Uh, one of them is an iPad Air and also crystals tarot decks, oracle decks, all that fun stuff. So please hit that subscribe button. Also hit the like button to help me circulate these videos. And if you would like to book a personal reading, the information's in the description box below. And let's get back into it. Obstacles. Week. We have adventure. So overcoming. Oh God, I kind of know this energy. I'm kind of familiar with it. I've kind of been there before. This person is always, they're, they're that Leo energy. They're driven, they're passionate, they're adventurous, they're spontaneous. So it's like you're going to be in that energy like, I'm never going to find somebody that's so fun, that I laugh with. We like the same music, we dance, we sing, we just, we can be ourselves together. We have fun, sex is really good. Like it, there's passion, desire, it's just a good time. Where am I going to find that in somebody else? Suppression. Turning a blind eye, but at the same time, it's it's hurting you. You know, like you're suppressing your emotions because you can't speak up to this person or you feel like if you do, it's going to scare them away because they're already not committed. 
and you're suppressing your emotions about this and that's not not good that's not good at all it's just gonna hurt you in the end i'm telling you this person can't be truthful they may have told you and they probably do this this is the manipulation they're probably you know calling you all the time hanging out with you all the time but doing whatever the hell they want to whenever they want to and they told you from the beginning they didn't want commitment but yet they call you all the time they hang out with you all the time they take you out they take you places they take you around their friends you may even have like gone on a like weekend getaway together like they're that they're they're saying one thing and doing another complete opposite here sorry about my dogs Sorry about my dogs. What else? Any other obstacles? Ordinariness. Yeah, overcoming just not finding this this quality in somebody else. It's it's false. It's not real. All right, I'll be right back. Sorry about that, Libra. All right, let's see what other messages do we have for Libra. What other messages? What else do we got for Libra? It's crazy, crazy energy. Surrender, detach, trust, free fall, have faith, all will be well. So surrender this, let it go. Mystery, I mean, use your own discernment, do what you want. I'm just saying it's like a karmic cycle. Uh, mystery, magic, intrigue, suspense, you're entering unknown territory. Yeah. Finding somebody different, finding somebody new, release, loosen your hold, relax, unwind, release fear, anxiety, and doubt, release, release them, loss, loss of self and identity, yeah, this person's making you like lose your mind and who you are and, and your morals and loss of self and identity, discover your true self again, travel, movement, meeting, adventure, be ready for new experiences, blessings, protection, attention, love, your guides are always with you, and split energy, unfocused, options, multitasking, decide what you really want. Whew. What other messages? Self-indulgent, focus on self, self-worth, time to heal, shadow work, and self-appreciation. Yes, 100%. I agree with that. <laughs> Focus on you. Cassette, outdated thinking, conditioning, replaying events over in your head. Yeah, because whenever you catch this person doing or saying something wrong, they project it on you. Why you were wrong. Why, why they did it. It's your fault. You know, like that kind of energy. And camera, reminiscing, keepsake, perception, learn from the past, make new memories. Girl with a snake, empath, narcissist, paradigm, being charmed or used, enabled, and boundaries. They're just using you. I hate it. I hate that energy. It's, it's here. Hey, what would they like to say? I still feel deeply connected to you, but I won't admit it. Yeah, because they can't admit shit. And I kept a facade to the world, but you always saw past that into my soul. Yeah, you saw right through them, but still... Still, they knew how to play you and pull at your heartstrings, Libra. I knew you were right, but couldn't admit it to myself or to you. Yeah. 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 All right, Libra, that is what I have for you. Please subscribe to my channel. Enter into the 10K giveaway if you'd like to book a personal 